Hi guys, in today's video, we are going to discuss about the important aspect of the chatbot, which is like, what is better, training phrase or custom entity? For this, I have created uh, two chatbots. So let's go over there. Um, okay, so we can see over here, we have two chatbots over here. One, uh, the example I have took is outage. So something like uh, when we don't have the power cut, uh, or there is a power cut from the supply, right? So there's basically the training phrases that we say, is, so these are the training phrases that I have used and there is a custom entity created, okay? So one bot only have the intent, oh, sorry, tra uh, training phrases. So this is, I think, without, yeah. So this one does not have any custom entity. So you can see that same uh, verbiage I have added. So I think there are around 12 or yeah, 11 hour training phrases I have added. Sorry, uh, 12 training phrases I have added. One page have 10, okay. Uh, same if we go over here. So there is, this is another bot uh, in this. We have created the entity. So first I will go to the entity. Okay, so you can see over here, I have created custom entity, which is named as outage. And these are the uh, similar words that a user can say, like outage, electrical outage, power outage, no power, no electricity and plug, all those things. So user can say all those things. So those as added as a custom entity, okay? Now what I've done, the same training phrases, which was used over here. So if you see power loss outage, I have outage over here. Same thing I have added. And uh, which were matched with the custom entity, those are highlighted in yellow. So if I click any of this, you will see it is pointing to that one. And this is the custom entity. I have not marked it as required uh, because what we are checking over here, which one is better? Is this solution better? Where uh, uh, what do you say, custom entities, which user can say as the similar words, right? Those as added uh, for the training phrases or directly you have the training phrases, okay? So now what I will do, uh, I will start the bot high, okay? So I have uh, already tested it out, but uh, to showcase which one is better, uh, what we are going to see is uh, confidence level, okay? Uh, the when we user says the power is off. This is not in the all the training phrases that we have. So something off, uh, like something uh, not which is mentioned in the, over here, but that is the uh, the meaning from the user perspective. It is the same. The power is off, right? So which is same as blackout or there is no electricity, right? Now what we are going to see over here is diagnostic info. Now in the diagnostic info, what we will see, the confidence level is 54%. This is without any custom entity. Now I'm going to say the same thing. So let's start with high again and the power is off. Okay. Now let's see what was, uh, what is the uh, confidence? So if you see over here, it's 46%, 0. 0.46. And over here, it was, I think 54. So around 8% difference. Okay. Same training phrases, only uh, difference is instead of the training phrases, uh, we have highlighted those common words as custom entity. That was an example where we saw that using custom entity is does not result in good recognition. Instead, it is uh, instead it is a less in confidence. Does not help in the NLP mechanism. Okay. Again, we are trying with the loss of power in this. Again, without uh, uh, custom entity. So we will see what is the percentage. It's 67%, okay? So again, we will try over here where we have with entity, okay? And we will type loss of power. So it detect the intent, so there is no issue over there. But what we will see is its recognition capability is only 50%. We see over here, there is 17% difference of improved recognition capability when user is saying, whatever that loss of power. So we get the percentage of 67, where when we are using custom entity, it's only 50%. One more example I will do. So again, it's quite similar. Uh, what is that? I would like to report an outage. Okay, so this is the common thing that user can say. And I give the 
training phase it has detected and let's see the confidence level so confidence level is 74 percent okay and let's try in the board where there is a custom entity created and you will see 72 so there's not big difference but still there is a difference in the confidence level so it's 72 percent over here it is 74 percent so so yeah that's the small tutorial uh, or uh, you can say the kind of a uh, experiment to find out which one is better to give actual training phrases or to give uh, custom entity and clearly with this example the small one that i have used uh, it is clearly visible that uh, the training phrases that you give has more power or more uh, accuracy towards the intent detection uh, with respect to the confidence level and again the custom entities or the entities are used to if you want to capture something common example is which size of pizza you want medium large and small something like that or like coffee latte or something like that so those are like the the information which you want to capture over here we are just giving the same phrases but it is not used by the system so that's why uh, it's better to use the training phrases instead of the custom entity uh, yeah that's all from my side thank you